Hello, you're watching New Vision TV News. I am Ruth Nasegi. This is the latest this hour. Activist Stella Nyanzi is at the International Criminal Divisions of the High Court, which is said to rule on her appeal in the case where she is accused of cyber harassment. By 11 a.m., Nyanzi was already in court and activists, including FDC stronghold Ingrid Trinawe, leader of opposition in parliament, Betty all were present present in court. Take a look. I could sing him a song. Yeah. I've been accused. <laughs> As she awaits for the verdict, it's never dull day with Stella Nyanz. Let's move on. Chadundu East Member of Parliament, Robert Senta Muchagulanyi, known as Bobby Wine, has this morning launched his presidential bid office in Kamucha, Kampala. The presidential hopeful declared his intentions to run for presidency last year. In other news, anti-leader General Mujisha Muntu says the meeting between Presidents Yoweri Kaguta Museveni and Paul Kagame of Rwanda will be a success. The two leaders will meet tomorrow at Anomani's land in Katuna, Rwanda, Uganda border. The meeting comes after the negotiations brokered by the Angolian President Jawal Luoresho. They will be joined by other presidents, Felix Tshisekedi of DR Congo and Dennis Sawo Nguess of Congo as witnesses. Number seven and Kagame signed an agreement in the Angolan capital, Luanda, in August last year, agreeing to end months of diplomatic and trade tensions. Away from Uganda, let's move on outside the continent. In China, coronavirus fears weighed on Asian markets Thursday, despite China reporting a big drop in the new cases and easing borrowing costs to caution the epidemic's economic impact. Traders have been betting on central banks, particularly China, China's doing what it takes to keep their economies shagging along as the new coronavirus hits corporate earnings and economic growth. In a widely anticipated move, the People's Bank of China lowered its one-year and five-year loan prime rates as policymakers seek to reduce the impact of the virus-fueled slowdown on companies and households. As is all we had for you this hour, thank you for watching. Be sure to catch my news updates and other programs here on New Vision TV by visiting our website, which is newvision.co.ud forward slash video. You can also follow us on our social media platforms. Facebook is The New Vision, Twitter is at New Vision Wire, Instagram is at New Vision Wire, and our YouTube channel is New Vision TV. Catch up with me on my Twitter handle. I am Ruth, the voice. Thank you for watching.